Woman keeps farting loudly in the toilet. She makes a loud noise and the toilet is in a mess. Her sisters outside are so surprised that they run away in a hurry. The woman is actually a male police officer who disguises himself as a woman in order to work on a case. Not long ago, Marcus and Kevin were out on a mission. But not only were the criminals not caught, they made a mess of the grocery store. The superiors were angry and warned them severely. One day, the police department received an assignment to protect rich girls. They were very grumpy. Everyone pushed each other and did not want to take this task. Marcus and Kevin thought it was a good opportunity to make a mark, so they took the job. They meet the two sisters and are treated like servants. Marcus C was taken by the dog and he had to be stuffed in the trunk. Halfway through the car, there was an accident. The dog was thrown out of the car window. In order to save the dog, the car turned into a ditch on the side of the road and cut the sisters' faces. The two sisters refused to go out and meet people because their faces were broken. If the two sisters do not attend the party, their mission will fail. This made Marcus so anxious that he wanted to hang himself. Kevin had no choice but to call in a professional makeup team. They made a model according to the two sisters' appearance and then sprayed their whole body with white paint. Finally, they put on wigs. Two strong men became sexy women but also attracted the attention of several men. They came to the front desk of the hotel and accidentally recruited their superiors. Luckily, the superior didn't recognize them and he kept paying attention to them. The superior took a liking to them. Then they met the two sisters' friends. The group complimented each other and came to the party together. They meet the sisters' enemies and start arguing with them. Marcus then picks up a big plate of snacks and leaves one for the waiter. Kevin is attracted to a sexy female reporter. He runs up to her and talks to her. He kept touching her hand. He slapped her arm so hard and spilled her wine. After eating his fill, Marcus ran to the bathroom and farted. Marcus came out very comfortable. Her sexy catwalk immediately attracted the attention of a man. Marcus was so disgusted by his action that he turned around and left. The man went to stop her, but was sprayed with pepper. This made the man even more fascinated by him. The sisters start shopping for the formal party tomorrow. The woman took a deep breath in front of the mirror. The sisters were dumbfounded by this. After they finished shopping, Marcus' bag was snatched by a thief. Marcus immediately chased after him. The thief was running wildly and accidentally hit a passing bicycle. He didn't care about the pain, got up and ran again. Marcus took a big girdle and crossed it. This made the two police officers next to him very shocked. Then Marcus jumped over the thief and took him to the ground and grabbed back his bag. At the dinner party, a girl had a crush on a man. She asked Marcus to help her with the powder on her nose. Marcus tapped on her face. The girl's face was instantly covered with powder, leaving the guy stunned. The charity auction was just about to start at this time. The men will auction off the opportunity to have dinner with the girls. When it's Marcus's turn to go on stage, Kevin is under the stage to raise the price for Marcus. He stomped on a guy's foot to get him to bid to dollars, zero, zero, zero. He spanked a man's ass for five dollars. 000, and tickled a man for $20. 000. Finally the man who liked Marcus ended the auction with $50. 000. The man was so happy and excited that he went straight to the stage and carried Marcus away. At this moment, Marcus has very mixed feelings. On the beach, Kevin changed his identity when no one was looking. He finds the kids and gives them $5 to do him a favor. He pretended to walk right past his favorite reporter. He shouted to the barman that he would pay for the whole thing. At that moment, two boys ran to him with a pen and paper and asked for his autograph. He managed to get the attention of the journalist and managed to get a dinner date for the evening. At the end of the night, Marcus went on a date with the man who won the auction and Kevin drove the man's sports car to the reporter's date. They both had their own entertainment. Marcus deliberately puts his feet on the table in order to get the man to give up on him. He bites off his fingernails with his mouth and spits them into each other's wine glasses. He also ate ugly and showed his round stomach after eating. And he also let out a loud fart. The dog on the side are covering his mouth. But the man loved Marcus even more. He looked at Marcus with deep love in his eyes. Marcus is even more helpless. On the other hand, Kevin and the reporter have already started to make out. They were kissing when Marcus's phone call interrupted them. The policeman ripped off a woman's bra. He suspected them of being men dressed as women. Then he ripped off a woman's pants. This stunned the whole room. The woman gets very angry and punches him in the face. When the police went to Marcus and Kevin's house to investigate, they found out the secret of their cross-dressing. They met the two sisters on their way to arrest them. So they arrested the wrong person. And at this time, 
Marcus and Kevin were hanging out at a bar. The man who likes Marcus also chased after her. In order to get him, he takes the waiter's advice and serves Marcus a drugged up drink. He was discovered by Marcus, who took the opportunity to swap the drink. The man drank all the wine in the glass in one go. Not long after drinking, he became hot and immediately went on stage and danced. The next day, he woke up and saw the man in his arms. He was so excited that he thought his dream had come true. But he's a man. <laughs> Marcus and Kevin had no good luck either. Their secret of dressing as woman was discovered, and they were fired. Along with two other colleagues, the four decide to continue the investigation. Marcus and Kevin came to the fashion show dressed as women again, and the two sisters they protect are also here. Marcus and Kevin were the first to appear. They just came off the stage. The two sisters also immediately appeared. The speed of dressing up directly stunned the audience on stage. Then the stage applauded. The camera kept taking pictures of them, but just then, all the lights went out and a pair of dragon dancers appeared on stage, surrounding the four of them. But the team withdrew and only the two of them were left on stage. They were the ones behind the scene and kidnapped the sisters. Marcus immediately rushes forward to rescue them. He jumped on the robber and knocked him to the ground. Throwing punches at him, the robber also started to fight back. He picked up a stool and hit Marcus on the head, but he was not hurt at all. This made the robber very surprised. He was knocked away by Marcus with a direct punch. When the robber intended to pick up the gun, he was stopped by the police who arrived in time. Finally, they successfully controlled the robber and successfully completed the task. The sheriff also praised them for this and restored them to their official positions. Kevin's heroic performance also won the appreciation of reporter. They finally fell in love.